Today, we're talking about the awesome success in our most recent weight loss challenge, where we had over 70 pounds of fat loss in eight weeks. In this challenge, we had 15 participants, and like I said, there were 70 pounds of fat loss, and our first place winner actually lost 16 pounds of fat in eight weeks. So today, we're talking about how we structure things, how we set things up, and how people got such awesome results in only eight weeks. Now, before we hop into this video, one of the most important things that you can do when you're trying to lose weight is you need to be eating specific macros and a specific amount of calorie amount for your goal and for your needs. And if you don't know how to do that and you don't know what your macros are, make sure after you're done watching this video, go down to the comment section, click on that link. You can fill out a form and I'll get your macros back free. I'll tell you exactly how many carbs, fat, protein that you need to be eating in order to reach your goal. Because if you are not eating consistent amount of food and you're not eating a specific amount of macros based on you and for your goal, it's going to be really hard to get to your goal. You're really just going to be spinning your wheels. So do yourself a favor. Know exactly what macros you need to be eating in order to reach your goal. So if you don't know, me and my fiance own a gym in Nebraska called Fit Grind. It is a personal training and small group training studio. And over the last eight weeks, we've been doing a weight loss challenge. Now, like I said, I'm going to tell you how we structured this, what we did, what clients were doing, how people saw us create results in only eight weeks. The first thing that we did in order to track our progress is we used an InBody 570. An InBody 570 scale is a BIA device that is going to track not only your weight, but it's going to track your skeletal muscle mass, your water, and your body fat percentage. So this is able to really give us our metrics and give us the ability to track the progress that people saw over the course of eight weeks. We had everybody weighing in every two weeks so that we could track the trend from week one to week eight and really see exactly where people were, how much body fat they were losing so that we can make tweaks along the way. One other really important factor in this challenge that is a huge reason why people saw such great success is the InBody 570 is able to track your basal metabolic rate. Now, this is a number that is unique and specific to each individual. And this number is the amount of calories that people burn at rest. So if you laid in bed all day and you didn't do anything, it's basically just the amount of calories that it takes for your body to function, not adding exercise or daily expenditure or any other calories burned throughout the day. So from this, we created custom macro plans and custom meal plans based on the individual and their own unique basal metabolic rate. And we were able to purchase an app and actually coach people and have them set up all their macros so that we could see exactly what they're eating on the back end. This is something that really helped a lot of people because a lot of times people have no clue how many calories they need to be eating or their percentage of calories is way off. So this is something that a lot of people were actually eating more food than they were used to and they were losing more weight. And that was the case with our winner. She actually was eating more food than she ever had. So in the past she was really restricting food and that's kind of what we really fall into is if we want to lose weight, we think that we need to eat less calories and we need to exercise more. But in reality, we need to be eating a specific amount of calories for us. And that's the really cool thing is this was a really healthy change for our first place winner. She was able to lose over 16 pounds of fat by eating more food. And she wasn't changing the way that she was exercising. She was, she was still exercising two to three times a week, but was able to see crazy fat loss, 16 pounds of fat loss in eight weeks. That was really cool to see. Another really cool thing of the bi-weekly check-ins on the end body, this really allowed us to make changes if we needed to, to our macros. So say, for example, someone was losing too much weight or someone was not losing enough weight. We could go in through the app. We could customize their macros and change things that we needed to make and make those subtle changes to help people get a little bit more fat loss. Or if they were really low in protein and they weren't hitting their protein, we could strategize how to hit their protein so that they could hold on to their muscle mass. Or if we needed increased protein or increased carbs, decreased carbs, whatever we needed to do, we were able to really make those changes according to what the end body was telling us, according to if their muscle mass is up or down, if their water was up or down, if their weight was up or down, if their body fat was up or down. We were able to coach and make those changes every two weeks so that we could really give people specific numbers and really use the feedback so that people could see awesome results. Now, as far as training and exercise in this program, everybody that did this challenge was also training with us in some capacity at our gym. People were training anywhere from two to four times a week. And these workouts were typically revolved around strength training is really going to allow us to hold on to muscle mass and continue to build muscle mass. So throughout the challenge, like I said, there was over 70 pounds of fat loss. Another really cool thing is there was over 20 pounds of muscle built throughout this challenge. So between those 15 members, 
there was over 20 pounds. That means on average, every member put on over a pound of muscle throughout the eight weeks, which is, which is crazy. A lot of times people will tell you that you can't put on muscle and lose body fat at the same time. But this is the prime example of that is totally possible. We actually had two different members in the challenge have over five pounds of muscle built in eight weeks. And by keeping our protein high, mostly everybody kept their muscle mass that they started with. And that is a huge feat when you're trying to lose body fat. Structuring your workouts around strength training and trying to build muscle is not only gonna help you keep your muscle mass that you have and help you keep building muscle, but it's gonna help you keep your metabolic rate high and it's gonna help you have more metabolic flexibility. So if you're trying to come in and you're trying to lose weight and you automatically hop on a treadmill and you do all this cardio, yes, it's gonna burn calories, but it is a green light for your body to get rid of muscle mass. The more muscle mass that we have, the easier it is to lose body fats, build muscle, maintain our weight, and like I said, have metabolic flexibility. So the more muscle mass that we have, it, it takes more calories for our body to function. That is a huge thing that is gonna help you lose body fat and really get in the best shape of your life and maintain that so that you don't just have to diet, you go back to your old way of eating and then you gain all the weight back and then you have to start from square one. So overall, this challenge was an awesome success over the course of eight weeks. Like I said, we had 70 pounds of fat loss. We built over 20 pounds of muscle with 15 clients. And overall, it was just a really great challenge. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. I just posted a video the other day. If you missed that one, make sure you go check that one out. I'll leave it up here. I gave you my three fat loss hacks that I've used to lose over 7% body fat in the last 90 days. So like I said, if you missed that one, make sure you go check that one out and I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs>